Okay, so I am back in the car, and that was a great trip to Walmart. You know, I got sent out to go buy some grocery items for my wife, and I ended up coming away with a lot of cool toys. And as you saw from the video, there was a lot of stuff on the clearance rack. And, you know, to be honest with you, at one point, I think I had everything that was on the clearance racks in my cart. And I really had to really just figure out what I couldn't live without and what I really wanted and, and you know, ended up putting a lot of the stuff back. So this is what I did come away with. So I had to buy, of course, this is He-Man, Masters of the Universe. I had to buy the Battle Armor He-Man. I mean, he just looks super, super cool. And for $13, can't beat it. Cannot beat this. And the back of the box right here, take a look at that guy. I mean, he looks super cool. Um, yeah, this is, I've not seen this uh, cartoon series. I've seen, uh, is it uh, Revelation? So I've seen that uh, cartoon series, but I've not seen this one. So definitely on my to watch list. So first purchase there. All right, sticking with He-Man. This next purchase, uh, I should say the next purchases, I really had to think about this. I wasn't sure, you know, whether I really wanted them or not. But of course, these are the uh, Eternia Minis, the, the gift sets. Now, but I will say, though, I am very, very glad I did pick them up. Because as you can see, they were marked down to $10.28. But really nice surprise when I got to the checkout. Because whenever I did ring these up, these rang up $3 each. So nice, nice surprise. Of course, I got the Fisto Stridor. And I got the Beastman, the Beastman War Sled. Now, I will say that um, after I checked out, I did notice, I don't know if you guys can see, I did see or find out that there was a crack on top of the bubble of the Beastman and the War Sled. But, uh, you know, I think for $3, I, I can live with that. So, nice pickups there. All right. So, the other pickups, and these, man, I tell you what. When I saw these hanging there, it, it I mean, I, it, it took me back to my childhood because I love, I love, as everybody knows, I'm a vintage collector. I love and really mainly collect vintage toys. Now, the newer stuff, you know, I do collect, when they're, whenever they do re-release the vintage lines, you know, I do have an interest in that. So, for example, when they uh, re-released the, uh, the the real Ghostbusters, I bought one of each just so that I could have the complete set. So whenever I saw these turtles hanging up there, oh man, I'll tell you what, it, it I got super excited for that. Now, I will say, you know, as you saw in the video, there were a bunch of these Donatellos. So got a Donatello. Uh, you also had a lot, uh, well, there was, you know, a lot of copies or a lot of the Leonardo figure. So, you know, got me Leonardo. Now, the next two, Michelangelo and Raphael, I tell you what, I did not know if, if there were any uh, on the racks, but thankfully, thankfully, the toy gods were, were they, they smiled down upon me, and, you know, they only had one copy or one of the Raphael, so I'm glad to have picked him up. And I found the only Michelangelo that they had on the racks. So, there you go. All of them, oh, he doesn't have a price tag on them, but all of them marked down to $9 each, and I am so glad that I came away with a full set. I mean, it does not get any better than that, man. I am so excited to have this full set. Cannot wait to display these, and like I said, they'll probably look really cool next to the uh, the, the re-released uh, vintage um, uh, Real Ghostbusters toy line that I have as well. So, there it is. That is my haul from today, and uh, I tell you what, I'm super excited, and I cannot wait to go home and, and uh, display all of these really, really cool toys I was able to pick up. So, um, listen, if you've not done so, do me a favor. Please hit that subscribe button. Go ahead and hit that like button for me, please. It really, really does help me out. Leave me a comment. Uh, if you've not done so, check out my other toy hunting videos. And, you know, I'll end it with, you know, like I always, always say, be safe, keep collecting, and I'll see you next time. Take care.